how the fuck are you even able to upload a video like four days a week, days a day? The, it's a lot, the Let's Plays. Yeah, sure. it's pretty straightforward, actually. So you first you record you a half an hour of video, and then you render it, and then you upload mm -hmm. it. And then you there's more time left more... in the day. There's even more time <laughs> left in the day if you uh, streamline those steps. Like, yeah, you record the episodes, yeah. it's more than one episode, for example. And then mm -hmm. you render them all together and upload them all together. Preferably yeah, when you're you not is... in the middle of using your computer for other things. Yeah, what you do is uh, you record in Black you know, guy pointing. at least an hour <laughs> and then you cut it in half. So that adds like maybe one extra step to your editing process because, hey, then you have to go in and cut a video in half. You will never find a more wretched hive of scum and villainy. That's, uh, that's the full quotation. Wretched. Wretched. I, I like every right r r word r right r r white except for r r wretched. What the <laughs> Fuck, dude. <laughs> I've seen people trip over sentences before, but like you fucking fell down the stairs and landed on your knee and Peter Griffin for three minutes. <laughs> well, I mean, I, I tripped on one word and then I turned it into a, a rule. <laughs> a rule. <laughs> so I guess you can just go get ruined. <laughs> oh my god. We haven't even started so playing, and I already want to leave. <laughs> yeah, I can finally. I, I'm. I hit continue. I finally was able to get in yeah. the game. Yeah. yeah Whoa. It's, it's, it's okay, it's over. Session. I got okay. to see some like fucking Sims Three grass. <laughs> that freaked me out a little bit. Before the uh, the the foliage loaded in, the ground was covered in. I get to find out. Crash. The fun. Every time I start this game, I get to find out whether I died last stream or not. And I just don't quit. remember. It's, it's because I never remember, and it's never good when I do that. And I don't know why I let myself do that because uh, it always means at the start of every tired. stream, there's 20 minutes. Yeah, it's because I'm really tired. Choice making is inhibited and whatnot. Like I have I really a rule. Like I have like a, a rule very... for not eating before bed, for example. Because I feel like yeah. it fucks with my sleep or something, but then sometimes I just do, and I'm like, why did I do that? <laughs> Remember the <laughs> rule and the past experiences? I really appreciate that you gave me an extremely gracious reasoning for why I do that. I yeah. was going to be much harder on myself, or just, but yeah. now I don't have to be. Or just all the so times where you. I'm just like, I should edit this instead of letting 20 videos uh, pile up. But contradictorily... I'm like, it's late, and I don't want to. <laughs> yeah, my schedule says that uh, after every stream, I need to upload, I need to edit my the videos I just recorded. Uh, yeah. I have never met that commitment. You've never <laughs> edited after a stream, ever? No, I've never, I've, even though it <laughs> says on my to-do list, like, hey, this would be a good time to do it, I have literally never... Uh, I've literally never made that made that commitment. So what you're telling what is me the is inspiration that inspiration for the stream title today, Bird. Oh my God, you immediately got a question <laughs> for it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there were some memes on Monday. Um, if you want to go down a huge rabbit hole, you can check out Sam Cedar and Steven Crowder. Um, and it was... be prepared to dedicate at least an hour and a half of your life to researching a meme. <laughs> that's that's a lot of work. I don't know why it would take that long. Yeah, I watched Sam Cedar's video about it like immediately after it happened, and even that was like, oh, was that three times that longer enough? than it had to be because he was like building too much. High... He was trying too hard to build up like uh, suspense about it, and he was talking really slowly for some reason. I don't no, have I... anything in my inventory, so <laughs> I guess I fucking died last. What? What was I doing? All I. What? Why, why is my inventory empty? Why do you always kill yourself? No. La I remember I last remember. time. I remember last time we we worked on the nuclear power, and that's just where we ended. Yeah. I remember. It was just. Um, I was looking at the nuclear power plant and just being like, "Hey, look at look at me! I did the thing!" Did, did you, doo -doo -doo. Oh, did you log out by the nuclear power plant? 
well, no. Hmm. Why would that make what? There's no radiation <laughs> next to the nuclear power plant, is there? Oh, <laughs> the, the, the radiation place? Oh, fuck. There's, oh, 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 okay, 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 this ain't so bad, this ain't so bad. Did you, right. not, ha did right. you not have your hazmat suit on? I did not have my hazmat suit on. Oh. At the time, the nuclear power plant, you were not um, dumping the the nuclear waste. Like, that wasn't, that was just sitting in the oh, plant, so it new, wasn't new, being used. new nuclear stuff came towards your body while you were logged out? Exactly, uh. exactly. So I guess you had... After I finished streaming, you went ahead and finished that component or something, and that's what that's what yeah, got oh, me. I made a drone port to move our waste away. I see. So that okay. it doesn't back okay. up and stop working. Okay. Okay. Terror has been um, has been abated. Uh, yeah. It has been replaced with typical levels of, um, you know, confusion and apathy. So that's good. All right. That's good. We're back to we're now. back to our, we're back in frame, so to speak. Just remember, <laughs> yeah, the nuclear waste dump is in that giant void of unfinished texture above the waterfall in the desert area. Remember that? Yeah. Or it's just a weird is flat it area with no just, details. Don't isn't there like just a giant death hole? Is it possible for us to just push the shit off somehow? No, we can't, right? The barrels, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't just, you can't just make something fall off the end of a conveyor belt. Yeah, I don't think you can just that make it fall off. Epic. One of the strategies that the wiki said was that they load vehicles up entirely with that stuff, and then they drop it in the hole. But then I guess that leads to performance oh. problems in the long term. So I think it maybe doesn't like cull that stuff entirely. Oh. Anyway, I just realized that I can, I could just throw three uh, power shards into this thing. To make it run at 250 percent capacity, the nuclear power You're using plant. Using power shards to make the nuclear power plant more powerful. Yeah, it just made our what? power generation stronger. That's the wow, great bar that went made a very big up. ass difference. <laughs> yeah, it went really yeah, up. Holy, holy, wow! I, All right, I wasn't that's quite pretty ready awesome. For that. that was. I'm surprised that that worked that well. Wow, that's really interesting. Well, we're, I, so we're doing good on power. What are these things? I don't know. Particle accelerators. Still trying to figure out this entire tier of the game. Uh, let's see. They can make a plutonium pellet or a nuclear pasta. One so of them. So you make of... a plutonium pellet from a nuclear owl. <laughs> Gross. Laugh, please. Thank you. Poopy. <laughs> you. you make it out of non-fissile uranium and uranium waste. Oh. Your mom's done for some Maybe we should uranium. send the waste here instead of wherever the fuck I sent it. Space to where I sent it. Uh, you I guess send a little bit. And then nuclear pasta is what would I make out of all that 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 copper powder that I was making, which is just without context, just seems like a really weird product. Powdered copper. Yeah, it sounds like something that you would get into your lungs and then uh, exactly. sue somebody for 20 years later. Like my first response is just worrying that it just fuck up your lungs or something. <laughs> like, oh yeah, we made we put we we just put copper powder in all of our walls because it was a good insulator and didn't really think that there would be any follow up information about that. <laughs> well, no, our company did a cost benefit analysis and figured we'd make more <laughs> money than we would lose in the lawsuits in thirty years. Plus, yeah. fuck it, I'm not going to be around. Money now, please. It's depressing how often that's the truth. It's like, oh, wh wow, who could have known? It's like, they always knew. They mm. just wanted to make money. It's such so commonly the answer. I swear I started making copper powder somewhere, but fuck me if I remember. Uh, Please don't remember, because I don't want to do that. You know. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Uh, oh, wait, I think Heathcliff is making copper powder. So if I go to the Heathcliff airport. <laughs> right, the, <laughs> the facility, not the cat. Got yeah. it. <laughs> okay, where do we have any uh, non, non fissile uranium being poodled out anywhere? Oh, that's a lot of uranium. That's, that's very fissile because it's hurting the shit out of me. <laughs> I was going to say, we only have so much nuclear stuff it's a quick check to find out whether or not we have it yet i, I figure <coughs> it's 
trying to get close enough to this shit that I don't get There's uranium. the copper powder. You're never safe. Okay, so those are your uranium fuel rods. You'll always get uranium. <laughs> uh, I said something gross on accident. And then you just, you just alley-ooped that into a slam dunk of lewd. Pressure conversion cube is made of a radio control unit and a fuse modular frame. Okay, I'm huh. gonna look up how to make non-fissile uranium. Ah! <laughs> okay, so you produce it in a blender. It's made of silica, uranium waste, and some other shit. And we use it to make plutonium, but why do we we care about that. What do we use it for? Nothing? Anything? I'm gonna go check out the space That is. I'm gonna work backwards from the space elevator. <laughs> that is exactly my question every time. It's, um... This what is it with this tier? It's, like, really hard to figure out. We just got a lot of recipes dumped on us at once without a context of how they, like, fit together in, like, a tree. Yeah. And they're also, like, abstract also very... ideas that are hard to understand without other and, additional and, context. So we're like, what even is it? What am I making? We're pretty late in the game, so like we're not really like none of these are really rewards. They're just kind of you know. Man, they're just more. Um Alumin so aluminum's definitely the choke point for a lot of stuff. I'm going to have to like just get more bauxite and scale up the entire like gray platform. <laughs> Yeah, we'd never have enough. So it looks like if we clad. felt like it, if we felt like it, we can just kind of stick a fork in the in the nuclear tier at this point because we just need to make the we just need to make the pasta. Um, and if we, I don't really feel like on, honestly, I really don't feel like messing around with plutonium or non fissile whatever the crap. It doesn't seem all that useful. Powered talk. Um, it's well, okay, yeah. <laughs> That was a quick uh, <laughs> roll over. I'm just like a dog. I'm like, oh, please, you have you, you win. You win. You're like, I give up you, immediately. I guess if you're going to call me out like that, uh, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't think it's about it that nuclear way. Pasta. Is nuclear pasta even made of anything nuclear? No, it's made of copper <laughs> and some other shit. It's a radio control unit, a fuse modular frame, and copper powder. And I'm, I, That's fucking and I'm dumb, bro. In, in the process what? of figuring it out. Yeah, no, it pisses me off, too. <laughs> That's fucking dumb, bro. Like, he... for real. <laughs> Why would you call it nuclear pasta if it doesn't have any nuclear components in it in the game that has a whole nuclear tech tree? Yep. And yet... None of that it is, is important. Part of the, it is Literally. part of the nuclear tier. It's, and I, I imagine Holy. everything in this tier is named after a thing that's real or something. Or theoretically All we real. Did. A real theoretical the thing. Whole... All we did with the nuclear stuff was just a fucking vanity project. Just to give ourselves some more electricity so we wouldn't have to think about it in the end. But, <laughs> but that's it. I and mean, there might be more it to was it. Just a... It was just a monument to our to desires to make nuclear. Right, so this is making pressure cubes. I just need to get the radio control units over here. Then also scale up well, everything because we have problems. Well, are we? I mean, the radio control units are plentiful. No, it's uh the the. Fused modular frames are made of aluminum casings. Uh, and aluminum oh. is uh, used in everything we ever do. And there's never enough yeah. of it. So at some at what, some what? point I need to scale up the entire gray platform to have more of all of the things that are there right now. Are we getting enough um What even is aluminium? Is it uh bauxite? Yeah. What's the what's the raw thing? Yeah. Uh, it's bauxite. And, right. We tried to find more bauxite, but we like couldn't because it's really far away. I don't know if I even remember for sure whether or not we're using all of the bauxite right now. Uh, That's a uh, good well, yeah, we can get uh, we can make we can go up there and make minor Mark threes up there. Okay, well that's worth doing. 
And yeah, then I assume we'll we have, have all the. Then we'll have like 50% more of all of our bauxite or whatever, and that'd be nice. Okay, yeah, that's probably worth doing. Um, I'll go ahead and get that going then. Pasta is made in a particle accelerator. Oh. Right. Oh, all right, Dan. It's over. It's not. It's not. It's not Tuesday in it. It's not. What is it? British Tuesday? Where you do British voices? <laughs> the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. I just don't. I just don't know what you're saying. Uh, I, I wasn't saying anything. It's Tuesday in it. <laughs> Have you ever heard a Brit say yeah. "in it"? <laughs> That's the, they have. There are they have also additional words. <laughs> <laughs> Is it? Uh, I I know some of the other the other uh, British words. There's wanker. There's yo wanker. Yeah. There's oi. They're loving, they're loving this. But not. Uh, but but not the Australian my, one. Oi. Yeah, there's 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 three different oys. A very different oys. There's oy, which is like JoJo anime. There's like, well, I don't really know. If I try to go oi, other ways, I feel like I'm just gonna do the Australian one twice. Yeah. <laughs> is, or or just wrong, just both of them wrong. So. Whatever. Chat, you know what? You're watching. Go ahead and just mentally substitute what you think the oys are supposed to sound like. <laughs> and, and I'm right. Especially if you're British. <laughs> British. Especially if you're British and Australian. You gotta say at the same it right. Time. You'll get both of them right. Like how, like how in Louisiana they say Narlins. <laughs> Not Narlins. There's no R. It's Nolins. Nol Nolins. You don't say it correctly, they'll know you'll be out yourself as. Uh, well, if they don't like you, you're just Californian. <laughs> Doesn't matter if they're you're from Louisiana. California or not. They're from Louisiana. They're not fucking from they live. They're not going to point at you and be like. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Where am I? Shit. I went too far. <laughs> I, I got all the shit to make the minor Mark 3s. I will be on my merry little way, and I will uh, report back when I inevitably die along the way. Cool. And then I don't think there's anything over there that can kill me, except for like the one little thing the of uranium. The massive gravity elevator, th uh, the massive sky yeah. bridge. And also several enemies, and there's also radiation and poison. In mm -hmm. fact, this kind of trip is what led to your last full episode of trying to get your body back problems. <laughs> it's Whoops. just enough of a variety of ways to die crossed with it being very far along, irritating mm -hmm. path to get there every time. So looking forward to the rerun. <laughs> Good luck, have uh, fun. I'll be fine, I think. But yeah, I definitely need to upscale yeah. the aluminum and the just everything at the petroleum area. Bird, does channel analytics tell you how many British people watch your videos? That's a good question. Uh, I well, think I mean, so. It, it, will, it will tell me, but I can also just tell you that I know of at least four based off of and that's direct all messages of <laughs> from British people. I mean, that's the realistically, census. realistically, it, well, I mean, there's more than four British people. There's got to be at least like Ten. They just all take turns being tracer. <laughs> Mom said I get to be tracer today. No, -uh, you was tracer last week. It's but <laughs> <for> true. <laughs> I get the cavalry on Wednesdays. I don't, I don't know what this joke is. <laughs> Can it be offensive if it's just confusing? <laughs> Chaos mode. No one's ready for it. <laughs> Copper. I definitely gave up on being on trying to clean this all up. 
It's so... Yeah, I understand oh, that. There's so much. <laughs> we definitely just, like, oh, fuck it, I'll just build it. <laughs> like... It's like, I can't do the fucking ten hours of city planning every time a new tier happens. You're like, okay, fuck it, it just goes here. How Absolutely. Bad, how bad could it go? It... it there it, we go. Um, Very bad. <laughs> yeah. No. No, it's fine. It's not like I could do any better. I mean, I'm one half of the equation here. If that much of the equation. Mm -hmm. Like now we you've I'm been more here like the whole time. shoulder We're monkey. Yeah, shoulder yeah. monkey? <laughs> I put it on the bottom. And I'm bird. Stupid. Why? Game, why are you like this? <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I put it at the bottom of the thing? Sometimes you just can't put things where you want them to put them. The game's like, huh? No. <laughs> Somebody in chat, we're not all Victorian Londoners. Okay, don't get your Olivers in a twist, yo. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> fucking got him. <laughs> All right. Let's get rid of this. <laughs> Mark three. I'll have to tear up the uh, conveyor belt out of it, too. All right, let's do that one. Fine. What's happening? Game. This game scares me with its late, with its delay sometimes. I just have to think to myself, like, is this the end? Is this the game? Is it done? Mm -hmm. I'm all out of love. I'm all out of patience. <laughs> I didn't really have any. Okay, 408 parts per minute. How much does a conveyor mark that one carry? <laughs> mark for 480. Uh, that's not gonna fly, is it? That has to be, well, no, that'll be fine. That'll be fine until it feeds into the big one. The big one is 780. Okay, I'm gonna make some notes here. So we have 480. Is it time for math? The dreaded scourge of Let's Plays. <laughs> Well, so the problem is that we our Mark V belts only go up to uh, 780, and with one Mark III minor, we're already at 480. So wow, that could but mean I, that we need a second. Aren't all, aren't the three bauxite deposits three different uh, sizes? Yeah, so it could be that one's pure, one's dirty, and one's real dirty. Uh, normal. And so it comes I think they were the like numbers. I think they were like pure normal and shit. Yeah, I don't know. We'll just see what it sums up, dude. That's that's all I can say. Uh, I'm falling. No, ah, oh, this thing's so awkward. Okay. Where do we? Are you a radio control unit? Ah, <gasps> you are. Wow, that made my job so much easier. You're just already here. Yeah. I love no, they're, you. They're, they're, they're not too bad, the radio control units. Okay, so this one is real shit. Yeah, impure. Really does not yield much in the way of um, ore fruit. It barely exists at all. Oh, uh oh, oh, that's a big enemy. <laughs> too bad I can fly. Okay, that's 480. And factor that into their math. It's 480, 120, Oop. and last one. Gotta find out. Ooh, underwater slug. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this little little friend with me. That's a purple one. I saw a uh, video earlier today of a slug. It um, it was slugging along, 
and then it <laughs> encountered a water droplet that was bigger than it, and the water droplet basically consumed the slug. Like, the slug was fine, but as soon as the slug touched it, the slug just became, like, completely wet. It was really weird looking. <laughs> like, it just fucking bubbled itself up uh, within a, a second. Yeah, it reminds me of uh, either Bugs Life or Ants had, like, one of them get stuck inside of a, bottle, uh, a drop That's of water. That's literally what it... That's exactly what it yeah. looked like. And it's like, wow, it a new phobia. Thank you. <laughs> Here's a weird new horror. existential horror to worry about <laughs> that just didn't need to think about. Floating suspended in the middle of drop of like water and having no escape. It could be worse. The ending of Finding Nemo, like, makes me uncomfortable to think about. Like they mm -hmm. reach their freedom and like they're just in these uh, spoiler alert uh by the way they get to so they're just in like plastic bags floating in the ocean and they're like now what do we do and i'm like that's disturbing as fuck like they're in a much worse situation now <laughs> they're basically like in prison but they've taunted themselves even more yeah but maybe another organism will try to swallow them and also choke and die they can take someone with them <laughs> Yeah, I guess that could happen too. You know, those kinds of extreme trap situations are rough. It's, a, it's part of the reason why it's really <laughs> harrowing to read The Martian. Yeah. To, to live yeah. in these situations where he's just completely and utterly fucked. And then they made a movie that minimizes most of the actual obstacles by just making the musical montages. But... The actor who played the main character, pretty hot dude. <laughs> so we had that going for us. And that's all that matters. All right, so we're at 480 plus 120. That puts us at 600, uh, 840. Okay, so that's that's still technically more than this conveyor Mark V can handle. But the conveyor Mark V is completely backed up, so we actually are very well equipped to just start consuming um wow Accel uh, accelerator things are scaling scary up our aluminium man i hope i kept physical notes of how that works <laughs> there was a lot oh, of math works. there was just a lot of math steps of how to of what rates of thing and how many how many you want of each building for at aluminium. each stage for the proportions from yeah, like the tree from like the the yeah. first thing that receives the box head all the way down to all the steps because there's still a lot of steps for aluminum. And uh yeah, that was a pain. It does look like it's hmm. I wonder if any of it's backed up right now though and not working correctly. Let's see. Uh probably some of our fluid isn't working. Yeah, we don't have enough wa water. We need more aqua. Very little water. These pipes are. This pipe is bone. Is practically bone dry. Hmm. So the whole thing's not working fact, right now because it doesn't have enough water. Yeah. The the pipe is basically not good. Yeah, because we split off of it twice. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh. So let's fix that. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. There's too many destinations. We just, yeah. we basically just need to make more w water yeah. creators. Which is <laughs> like the easiest thing to do. Yeah, no, we just need, just need more water pumps, and then bring another pipe up, yeah. and then yep. split off some of that, so it's not all just in one pipe. Yeah, exactly. All we really need. Spoilers for Finding Nemo, a movie that came out in 2003. What the fuck? It came out in 2003. God, spoiler <laughs> tag that. Jeez. Why didn't you spoil time? <laughs> it's always Damn. interesting when people are like spoilers. The nerve of some people. Why did you tell me the Titanic sinks? I was I wasn't that far <laughs> yet. It's, it's a long. I was taking a break. It's a long movie. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Yeah, imagine me? getting getting two thirds of the way through the Titanic and thinking it was a comedy the whole time or something. <laughs> <laughs> what, because of the acting? Uh, oh! Uh, he has an Oscar now. She got one first, though, I think. <laughs> <laughs> he got an Oscar by being like, oh, look how much I suffered. That's what acting is, right? Yeah. Just condescending. <laughs> More like Leonardo DiCaprio, am I right? <laughs> mm -hmm. There's some Mad Magazine tier fucking roastage with that one. And I was like, yeah, what is this, SNL? This, this fucking <laughs> high level of comedy? The fucking show where they're like, they gave Wario an Italian accent. Oh, the way he's known for speaking, of course. <laughs> it's a me, Ma it's a me, Wario, the villain from Mario. I talk just like this. <laughs> The villain. So fucking annoying. Uh, yeah, it's so a, awful. I mean, Bowser, yeah, but still. <laughs> no, 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 I understand. I'm just, <laughs> I, I just believe it. It's just, your, your verisimilitude I'm... was, was very <laughs> It's just the level point. of, that's the level the comedy was on. I was, I was like a, de I was a deer in the fucking headlights watching that episode. Which, it's just a massive coincidence, too, because I don't care about SNL. And it was just this perfect storm of like, oh, I'm visiting family. Oh, they're watching SNL. Oh, it's Elon Musk. People are going to be talking about this, aren't they? <laughs> Here we go. I'm in the zeitgeist. Isn't this fun? <laughs> mm hmm. Sure would like to be watching something funny instead of important. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really sick of his fucking embarrassing brand of like gamer girl comedy. Like, he's the fake gamer that everyone accuses other people of, but because, like, he just wears it as, like... He wears being, like, some kind of super nerdy gamer guy as being, like, a PR move to make nerds like him and worship him online. But it's the most fucking base-level embarrassing stuff. Like, yeah, huh, I'm a nerd. I like Star Wars, but coming from, like, a actual middle-aged man with infinite money that's doing it as, like, a the fucking thing is... performance... Uh, very, very few people buy it anymore, right? Like, the only person I can think of who's still unironically like a Elon Musk fan is fucking Jonathan Blow. So, <laughs> oh, <laughs> like, no. it's basically just down to him at this point. And, like, I don't really know anybody that buys into his bullshit anymore. And if you do, fucking stop. <laughs> if you're watching this and you, <laughs> and you still think You're anything positive us. at all about Elon Musk quit it <laughs> just, just stop man just come on just stop <laughs> just come on man just come on <laughs> <laughs> adaptive control you know are we making those yeah I believe we are they're used for um seems familiar. For flying robot friendos flying robot friendos they're more than eats the. They're great. <laughs> Ow. I don't know what this thing was for, so I'm just gonna make it do this. Remember the time that Elon Musk and Grimes had like a marital dispute publicly? <laughs> no. Social media was a mistake. Just the concept. Yeah. Just imagining like like my the idea of like my parents fighting on you on like YouTube or Twitter or something. Oh, <laughs> like, oh god. Like, why, is, why is this happening this way? Oh, oh that sounds awful. <laughs> Someone has like watched their parents fight on Twitter. And they're a billionaire. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with this pipe? Is anything happening correctly gets, right it, now? It gets all too real when you're one of the final, like, five famous people on the planet that actually managed their own Twitter account. <laughs> I have no idea. I, I recognize Adaptive Control Unit as something I've seen before. But uh -huh. I have no idea where we're making it at all. Uh -huh. If anywhere. Uh-huh. Yeah. Let's, where's my search button for our base? <laughs> I need one of those, please. 
Oh, I need to attach power to the to the to the pump to the to the initial extractor of the water. Maybe it's in the tower. Well, it's made of computers, and I think we still only have one building in the entire base that makes computers <laughs> somehow. So if I just check, if it's I follow kind of the like the world right now, isn't it? I, yeah, <laughs> that so one I, base so is if, Taiwan. If I just follow <laughs> all of the computer treadmill track uh, conveyors, then I'll I'll know where uh, the only possible places it could be hiding at this point. Yeah, that's another thing that has to scale up. But that, but I, every time I think about that, I, I remember that the only way to scale up computers is to scale up our entire petroleum situation because all of our petroleum products are too slow. Yeah. What if they would ever add Factorio style drones to this game? Probably not. I definitely think that. So Factorio drones are kind of an amazing feat of Factorio. <laughs> like. They're incredibly cool. Um, what they did and the programming that they had to put into it is it would be kind nuts. of a nightmare I, to, if they had to render them in 3D swarming everywhere. Yeah, I don't. I don't think that you'd like, get a you'd get a big like horde uh, swarm of bees chasing me feeling. Yeah, I mean, no offense to the satisfactory dubs, they're fantastic, but like, that's asking a lot. <laughs> like, I, like the drone thing from Factorio is extremely extremely difficult to program. Why is this pump... Why is this water extractor not good? Do more. Where I are command we making... you to do more flow. Automated wiring. I can't find this. I'm 20 meter per thingy. But this is so... I'm this is go, so little. I'm trying to go backwards on the hierarchy now, like... Okay, like the adaptive control unit is made of automated wiring. Where's automated wiring? <laughs> Either. The heck? Why is this bad? Amount of water and pipe is like none. Current flaw and extractor. What's going on is like not is water not coming out of it? Is it powered? Well, yeah, it's powered, but like the flow rate is really, really low on it. Is is <laughs> the wire going up? I mean, is the 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 pipe going up? Yeah, barely. Is there a, a you, pump? I mean, further up ahead, but like it's really only going up like maybe a foot. Like it's really negligible. Is that a mid wiring? I don't know. This is weird. Maybe it just needs. Maybe I should just make the pumps do. Um, maybe I should just join the join two water extractors. Just do it that way. Um. Can the stack handle more? Well, they one way to find out. Two okay, vertical. So now that's doing that. It's just, it's just sitting here. Okay, now it's extracting. I don't understand why they're acting this weirdly right now. Okay, this looks like it's working a lot better. Okay, I guess I was just consuming um, way more water than a single extractor could uh, could provide. Maybe. It does usually take a bit to like fill up and get going, but I can't really mm. troubleshoot it without checking it myself. Okay. And that's well, things work. are looking things are looking all right now. Uh, 
Okay, cool. I can always just fall. That's totally fine. <laughs> Is it your jetpack? No. Yeah. No. No, my jetpack is cool. Manly. <laughs> I have an alpha jetpack. <laughs> yeah, I'm a sigma jetpack. <laughs> I'm the sigma is male. Good? Is that good? Is that bad? I legitimately don't know anymore. Uh, I mean, it's bad if you unironically mention it ever, but that's, okay, because, that's more descriptive. But no, like, okay, sigma males uh, are supposed to be the ultra alphas, because now alphas are classified as caring about what people think, but sigmas are truly independent lone wolves, which is also what they call mass shooters, but whatever. Who's keeping track? <laughs> There's a bunch, just a bunch of fucking stupid thumbnails going around of, like, John Wick, Keanu Reeves. Uh, once, always a fictional character, never real people. Uh, and that's the idea, that's the new ideal of masculinity, is getting your dog shot. <laughs> <laughs> That's the, is that the trick? Is that how you become a Sigma male? Is you just gotta get your dog shot? <laughs> and then other stuff happens, probably, in that movie. <laughs> probably. The, uh... <laughs> I was on Kickstarter and I saw this comic called Good Boy. And it was, uh -huh. it was clearly like an angry dude in a suit that's gonna go do a shooty movie and so on. But... <laughs> It was a dog in a suit, and I'm like, I'm like, I think what? I know what this is. Even even without reading it, I think I know what this is. And I went on to read it, and it was, which is that it's it's a John Wick parody where it's the dog avenging John Wick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, oh, that's fucking great! <laughs> oh, that's awesome! I love that idea. <laughs> so, <laughs> what a fucking what a fucking premise. I keep looking at. I keep. Sigma male is when somebody has the potential to become a Chad, but chooses to not become one. I'm sorry, I can't even respond to that. <laughs> like I know that you're just telling me. I'm not. It's a. I'm it's a you're, you're, on you're you, Chad like, Sundere. <laughs> I don't. I don't even really like, want to be a Chad anyway, Vaka Chan. <laughs> I just. I can't. I can't. I can't right now with that one. Just, damn. That, that's that's too much internet. Just that's, too much internet. That's, that's Sigma a male. Lot of, if if you know Sigma that's male, a lot, man. It's, it's even a meme. Then you already like have reached the point where you're terminally online. <laughs> Hello, me. <laughs> wow. It's weird. It is weird to get your entertainment and your money from the same website that you can just live on all day. <laughs> Here I am. Yeah. Okay, so what did I accomplish by doing this? I kind of got distracted by my <laughs> stigma mail conversation. I think I think we fixed the, oh, the water situation. Yeah, okay. I, I managed to... Uh... Okay, good. The person who told me that is also saying that their reaction was the exact same as mine. I'm just, what the <laughs> fuck is this? Did you fucking good, say to me? Good, you're 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 sane. You get to keep the my bird catcher mark of friendship. You got that going for you. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so water is still yeah. flowing into the aluminia solutions. We still could probably do um, even more water, so I can do another extractor. I think. Um. Cause that's oh, yeah. Shit. There, we need more right. water. We need more water going in here. Oh, no, you better Which go catch crazy. it. <laughs> the, well, you got it's your water you got running that out of your system. <laughs> I'm not pregnant. <laughs> Whoa, that's very different. Well, I guess I wouldn't. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I mean... I mean, I guess technically insert, our water is broken, but that's not what I meant. Insert fan art now of pregnant bird. Please, <laughs> for the love of God, I don't make that. <laughs> anybody, anybody, please do not make that. Well, the, the more uh, you ask for it, the less convincing it is. Okay, then I'm going to drop it like a hot potato now. Um, like that baby! I wonder if I even need to... <laughs> 
I need to pump this a little <laughs> bit more. You made it this is too I easy. I didn't get it. Sorry. Because people call babies potatoes. Oh yeah, they do. And you dropped it. Oh, wait. Drop the baby. What? Uh, you lost me. It's fine. It's hard to okay. joke and also think hard game. <laughs> so much, <laughs> so much brain space being consumed. <laughs> just, <laughs> just, I just pictured a gorilla saying that sentence. <laughs> <laughs> It hard think and make joke or something, and then like another gorilla is like, like talking to me like like no, do both or something. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. can I make the thing yet? I can make the thing yet. I need heavy modular frames. Shit. Are I'm you a heavy a heavy modular frame cedar yet? Uh, Fucking, I would do anything. I. I would fucking lose my mind if Sam C if I found out that Sam Cedar ever watched me somehow. Like he <laughs> he just watched me for whatever reason. I would be so stoked about that. You have no idea how cool. Like that would make my week, maybe even my day, before the crushing reality of everything else would set in. But it'd be a sweet twenty-four hour window. <laughs> <clears throat> Don't let it set in. Don't let it. <laughs> a dread. No, I've uh, I don't, I don't really even. I kind of know who he is. I never, I, I don't think I've ever watched his show. Me neither. Ed it's Var. really boring. It's <laughs> really, really boring. You just like him because of this thing that happened, dude. Well, okay, so I knew of Sam Cedar, um, because it was like, isn't he just a voice actor? Like, why is, why is he suddenly, like, the talk of the town? Yeah, he's, like, a writer and a voice actor for Bob's Burgers. And I was like, what the f Wait, he also writes a political show or something? And then everything else just kind of happened, and it was like, okay, yeah. I guess I'm gonna... You know. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good story. That was a good story. Um, let's throw some more. Ah, jeez, maybe another water extractor is required for this. We probably just need to send another pump up that doesn't even join anything. Uh, just to just to start a new line with better throughput. Just like one for each of the uh, different things that has to go uh, that needs water. That's sort of what I'm arriving at, but I don't think I'm going to get to that level of granularity just yet, unless it turns out like that it's really bottlenecked purely on our throughput. But I don't think we're going to need to get to that level. I could always be wrong, though. I hope not, because I mm -hmm. hate being wrong. Every time I'm wrong, it's a pain in my asshole. It's not <laughs> your favorite. It's always it's always bad when you add hole. <laughs> I know, I know. It just I makes know. it so much worse. It's so much it's, worse. It's always so unnecessary. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, that characterizes this person. Mm hmm No, I, 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 I chose my word very carefully because of, mm -hmm. I, I wasn't going to say it at first, but then I was in the middle of the word ass, and I was like, I can make this worse. And then I did. Did you see the ad, the, the trailer for the movie Karen? No. One of the things that people are talking about a lot right now. It's, um... Yeah. A choice. What is it, like a horror movie or something? <laughs> yeah, like, there's people who think that it's, like, a really, like, cheap knockoff of Get Out or something. Because of its, like, its tone. It's specifically about, like, Karens versus a black family. Well, like, a horror Karen versus a black family. Like she's gonna call the cops Wait, on she... you. Here she comes, and that kind of. When you say like a horror tone. Karen, do you mean like she's like from like fucking The Ring or something? No, like just it's just a Karen, <laughs> I guess. Oh, okay. What's, okay. What what I was what I was surprised by is they went with the character that plays the meth head from uh, Orange Is the New Black, and I'm like, 
that's who you got Karen vibes from? <laughs> of all the... I don't know what else she's been in over the years, so maybe I've no there's roles I've missed that gives context to that choice, but I'm like, she's like the anti-Karen in that show at least, and I'm like, and it, all I can think of is, the, hey, it's that lady from Orange is the New Black. Uh, this isn't working. <laughs> like that's my entire reaction to the trailer. Mm. Is like her the casting is incredibly strange. I don't know. I have never watched Orange is the New Black, so I don't know anything about. Or, so what's up with her character? Is it like it's what makes like it a really weird choice? It's like if you cast Jesse Pinkman or uh, okay. Aaron. Shit, what's Jesse's name? I knew it. Uh, Aaron. Aaron. Brock of. Aaron Brockovich. Yep, you you named it. Named it. Named it. <laughs> named it. Named it. God. Okay. Um. Aaron, Aaron Paul. Paul. There we go. I was like, Aaron Paul. Yeah, he's good. Any okay? Before we go on with this, anybody whose name is two first names, is it's fucking impossible to remember their name. Yeah, like Brian David <laughs> Gilbert, so David annoying. Brian, Brian David David <laughs> Brian David Brian David Gilbert. <laughs> okay, well he's easy enough to remember because no, he's got, I'm wrong he's every got three. time. Really? Uh, yeah, I know it's a Gilbert at the end, but the rest is just a fucking guess. Like I just, I oh, know, wow. I cannot keep David and Brian straight. I don't ever know which one's the first one. <laughs> I type the wrong wow. one all the time in, and it doesn't matter because they're just three words you're, type you're typing into a search bar, so it just gives you him anyway. <laughs> so I'm never corrected, <laughs> and I never have to figure it out. But I can never tell you which name is his first name. If I ever met him in person, I'd accidentally call him by his middle name, probably, and it'd be really awkward. <laughs> if you, if I even tried to do the thing where people summarize him as three letters, I would do it wrong because I'd put them in the wrong order. <laughs> do GBD or something. <laughs> Yeah, All I okay. know is Gilbert is okay. last. That's the only one I can remember. Yeah, fair. Fair. Logan Paul. Just not a great naming scheme, His name scheme, is easy honestly. enough to... What? Just not a great naming scheme in general. No, it's really frustrating. So if you're out there and you have, uh... Your name is two first names. Uh, my suggestion to you is get married. <laughs> <laughs> carefully. Just do everyone a favor. Just get married just take carefully. Care <laughs> you can, there's a very well, I mean, discretion you can, is yours, but... You can still fuck it up. That's true. It's not like having all first names is a recessive gene that goes away <laughs> to just by luck. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you can... You, that's true, okay. M marry somebody, but ensure that their last name is not the same as your first name, because we don't need Paul Paul or Paul anything Paul. like that. Like <laughs> Paul <Let's>... Paul. <laughs> I mean, like, his like, his name is like the seventieth problem with Logan Paul. <laughs> <laughs> I I I would have several other notes first, <laughs> if I were to be honest. <laughs> There's a multitude of, uh, of other. Th He's a real fixer upper. <laughs> oh, oh, Paul. <laughs> In fact, I don't want him to have a. I don't want a cute name that just like hides the demon in, inside. <laughs> uh. A name ain't gonna fix that. <laughs> Or did you see the hug fest between Logan Paul and Floyd Mayweather? I mean, if you ask me if I've ever watched anything, chances are no, but I have seen the memes of everything. Like, <laughs> if something happened, then I've seen the memes, so the answer becomes yes, insofar as I've seen, like, the internet You've seen version the distilled of version. The notes. Yeah. You've seen The Last the Jedi notes. in that you've seen widescreen that one actor that used to be in the military. Um, <laughs> in Adam Ridley. Adam Driver. Yeah, wait, there we go. Right. Adam Driver. Adam. Did you say Adam Riddler? Yeah. No, Ridley. I mixed him oh. up with with them. Um, Ridley's with, um, believe it or not. No. What's the what's Ray? What's her name? Daisy. Uh, Daisy Ridley. Yeah, I got them. I got them mixed up. 
I saw her I in a movie with Spider-Man. Where they could see their thoughts or something. Hear their thoughts, yeah. It was an this incel movie about incels? <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Spider-Man lived in a society where uh, the, men, the men's thoughts would play out loud. And so they killed all the women because the women could hear what they were saying or what they were thinking. And that's a hell of a... It sounds like a really fucked up, like, serious dark movie, but it was like a YA ad adaptation. <laughs> like, it's that tone. So it was weird. And Daisy Ridley shows up in a weird looking wig. So she, and she looks like she's gonna say multi-pass. Uh, and she's the one woman on all of Earth. And then I saw Monster Hunter. Whatever you said <laughs> isn't real, right? Like, real everything movie. that you said that's, was just memeing at me. That's a one billion percent real movie that I saw at a hotel. What's it called? Uh, chat. Help. Me. I don't, I'm not Googling that shit. <laughs> it has like a... F it's like one of those YA titles, like Mortal Instruments or whatever. Like, <laughs> not that one, though. Uh... They'll get, they'll get to us eventually. Or they won't, I don't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're on hold with that? chat. <laughs> <laughs> now we're making... Your call will be uh, uh, answered in the order we receive. Please note that we're experiencing a higher volume of when are you going to play this game <laughs> than usual at this time. <laughs> a higher volume of of when are you gonna play the next Zelda? Play <laughs> play the the Ganon Sword. Play Hotel Mario. Not, play the Wand of Wand of Ganondorf. Whatever it's called. The Wand of Ganondorf. The one from the Philips CDI. <laughs> it's like Legend of Zelda and the Wand of Ganondorf. Yeah. <laughs> so what? I, like, I like saying and the Wand of Ganondorf, which means it makes it sound like the Legend of Zelda is an entire character's name. <laughs> like it's, yeah, it's like a Harry, like Harry Potter and the Wand of Ganondorf. Yeah. <laughs> the Wand of uh, Gamelon. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. No, I, I, I. Yeah. Would not be surprised if I eventually get around to playing literally every Zelda game ever made, including the worst ones. Maybe even especially the worst hey, ones. People keep paying you to do it, so... Yeah, I mean, I might have... If enough <clears throat> time passes between them may making me do it, I might just do it on purpose. <laughs> Even eventually, I'll just be like, hey, play the Zelda. Granted, there's a lot of other franchises where it's like, when are you going to play the entire Resident Evil franchise and the entire... Yakuza franchise any day now. It's easy, huh? <laughs> Yakuza's a fucking moving target, too, because they make, like, a game every year at, while you're trying to keep, get caught up on the series. You're like, no, there was already, like, 12. Why, now there's another one? They do pump them out, though, man. They're they're good. That's the one of the upsides of having your entire franchise be set in one city. Yeah. Hard asset. Highly yeah. reusable. You just up you just upgrade Kamarachi every few games, but mostly you're still you're still using the same place overall. Wow, why is the flow rate on these so fucking bad? I wonder if there's like a really old Weird. texture somewhere that they just have like forgotten about. <laughs> and they haven't updated it for like generations at this point or something.